Right, this is how to clean out your Beko washing machine's um, detergent drawer. Find it across the top, obviously where you want to locate it, put it out. And then you'll see a blue button release. So you push down and pull. Push down and pull. This is improperly. Okay. Just to show you again, I actually pushed there and not there. Right. What we need to do is clean this out. Um, we also need to clean the jets out under here. Amazingly, there is actually no build-up of residue inside. So we just need to clean this, really, ideally. Um, but what you would need to do, normally, is that you would have to clean the jets around here, um, up here, using a cloth, etc, and toothbrushes. But in this case, if you look, these are immaculately clean. So we just have to focus on the drawer today. What to do now is to bring your decision drawer to the kitchen sink or any sink. And the best way to do this to remove everything without using actual detergent is just to run the hot water. Right. And using a cloth or a toothbrush, you can clean. Remember, you need to use warm to hot water. Uh, to remove your scum, use this sponge cloth which I just found. Amazingly in the sink right there. Oh my God. Use the soft sides. Be safe. Um, you can use the abrasive side because it is plastic. This is a top plastic here. Don't use it on the front there. So take this out, you need to just grip there and there and lift up. Easy peasy. Uh, there is actually paint there. Not paint. Right, so now it's done. What we need to now do is place this back in. So, to locate, simply push this over this bit over this, this hole here. Right, these should be level here and here, and then push down. You won't hear a click, click, but it should be in. Right, now we'll take this back to the washing machine. To finish off the drawer, to put it back in, just simply you'll see two prongs here, place one on that side and that side, push down on the blue release. There we are. That's not the easiest thing to get back in. Uh, just be careful with your fingers, you don't accidentally cut them. Then wipe down with a towel, and you're done. And clean drawer back in its place. Thanks for watching, guys.